Thank you. Yay! Okay. Right, you ready to leave the car park? Yeah, but which? Go again, this one's going, yeah? The far right one. <laughs> the far right, yeah. Okay. Cancel. Cancel. Um. <laughs> okay, this side, yeah? This is my right side. Yes. Okay. Left. I'm dyslexic, okay? So. Okay, that's not going, but it's not going. Great. Yes. Okay, wait, let's start from the beginning because it's been a while. Okay. okay. And I haven't driven this car before, so. Yes. Yeah. Um, I haven't told you about this, so I do need to tell you. Yes, please. No stick, just buttons. Okay. To, yes, like a stick, to choose a gear, if you like. Yeah. Hold the brake pedal. Okay. And then choose which one. So, obviously, we're just mainly going to be using drive. Drive, okay. Yeah, we we'll do a little bit of reversing later. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, if you just go ahead and press, uh, hold the brake. And hold press the brake. D. That's the one. <laughs> and then, uh, what we'll do, just to give you a smoother move off. Okay push this handbrake down, just like releasing a normal handbrake. Yep. And then now, whenever you do release the brake, the car will very slowly move, because okay. the handbrake's yeah, up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So just be a bit smoother. Okay. When you are ready, we're just gonna go down this little bit where the arrow is, and yep. just follow the arrow. Okay. okay. Take your time when you're ready. Oh my Drive gosh. On. Oh my gosh, I haven't driven in a while. I remember my position unit used to be off, remember? When I used to click cars, <laughs> I used to drive too closely. But what's the speed limit? Yeah. I usually walking speed. Okay, so like yeah, car, car parks, yeah, quite slow. Okay. Now it's a bit of a tricky car park to get out of. So we're just going to go across to that middle section if there's no one there where the white van is. Okay. Maybe the red car goes there, yeah, lovely. Yeah. Just kind of follow the red car, and we're going to go all the way up, okay, and just keep following the arrows. Okay, hey, hey. smooth. Gonna put more because the thing going up. to the right this time so if it's mm -hmm. safe we'll just go through the gap on the right. The right okay but do I signal? If you want to yeah no harm can help. I need to check my mirrors when I signal right. Good one yes. Kidoki. Lovely yeah we'll just follow the arrows. Well do I signal when I follow the arrows? Mm, yeah correct no no you don't. Okay. So if it's just a follow no other way we can go. Yeah. As you know, sometimes you just overdo it because you know the instructions. So, it's, there's no real big harm in signaling. So, yeah. if you're unsure, it's better to always just use the signal. It, yeah. Yeah. I just know some people could be extra. Yeah, I'd rather just do it than get it wrong and get a minor. Exactly. Yeah, it, yeah, there you go. If you want to look at it this way, it's more chance of you failing for not signaling yeah. than failing for signaling. Yeah. Does that make sense? Yeah. yeah. Also, we didn't do our eight point check before we left. Yeah. Did so, we still do that, right? No, it's probably the easy answer. <laughs> I'll come to that in a sec. So we're just going to go. Okay. So, yeah, if there's no danger, you don't need to look. Okay, because remember yeah. before moving off, I remember, because that was the old test, though. Remember how they changed the testing system? Oh, you're good. Yeah, oh, fine. still? Yeah, okay, just keep going the up. exit. Yeah. Well, yeah, we'll just go through this way. It'll take a background, so right. you can follow the exit signs okay. now. Yeah, cheers. Right. So if you want to take any shortcuts, you can divert through these sections. Oh, oh you go. Ah, I'm gonna because I don't know this area. I don't even know this car park, so I'm just gonna. Yeah, let's talk about car park. You know how you're saying about the eight point check? Yeah. Did that look close to that car? No, you did absolutely brilliant. Yeah. Yay! Yeah. Um, equal sides on both. Oh, you had the wall and you okay, had the car, cool. so you had equal sides on both. That was mm -hmm. nice. From the car, it feels like I'm closer. Like on your when side? In, like when I'm being in the car, I'm yep. looking outside, yeah, yeah. I feel like I'm going to scratch the car. Do you understand? You'll get more used to this vehicle because you've yeah. just driven it for two minutes so far. Yeah. Yes, I get that feeling. The car will feel a lot bigger than what it is yeah. to start with. You'll get used to that real quick. All right, let's just follow the exit signs. Okay. I'm gonna signal the summons to signal. Listen, I said mirror signal dead. 
Wait, bird check, mirror signal, right? That's if right I remember now. correctly. I didn't, I'm just signaling without even checking. Which is crazy, don't try this at home, please. Okay. Oh, slow nail. Oh, people behind me. Yeah, there go. I'm not turning. I'm it's really gonna like tight. Okay. Whew. <laughs> I felt like a heavy. That's just got a better at No, yeah, I can't get this okay. one. Fingers crossed we don't get stuck. There's a lot of traffic going out this way earlier. The gate should just open as you get closer, so just uh, approach the gate nice and gentle. And then the camera will read the number plate. Those guys are angry. Sorry, it's not serious. Why is it not reading? Hmm. Maybe you have to just take it, no? Hmm. It's good to take it as well, actually. Try reversing a little bit, so just click this down, because the camera might not be able to see the number plate. It might be a bit too close. Again. Nice with your April check. So remember how we said it wasn't necessary before, because there was nothing behind yeah. us? Now there could be, so well done for checking. Okay. Yeah, I don't know. The camera's right there. Not checking. All right, do you want to try the ticket then? Okay, let's try the ticket. All right. Just get out of reverse. Is that how you do it? Uh, so it's still in R for reverse. So if you want reverse... Do Yep, D for drive. Okay, cool. So what did you want to do? Park the car or drive? Drive. You want to drive? Okay, yeah. so you're in the right gear for driving. Yeah, because I want to get closer. Cool. I'm going to be with it. <laughs> Should I put it in handbrake? Maybe park as well. Park. Just in case. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Which way is it? Uh, barcode up. Okay. Car's not permitted. Is it this way or this way? Uh, so yeah, just like that. It should be fine either way. As long as the barcode's up, it usually reads it. Okay. Oh, after 10 years oh, later. Bloody hell. Why did you fit the one that didn't even move? The gate closes in three seconds. Oh my gosh, don't do that. Drive. No, I have a break. Wait. How do I go? Oh. Okay. Okay, cool. Whew. Okay, you did it. We're done. <laughs> that was a little bit scary. Didn't know what to do. I think I handled it well. I you like did. this car. Yeah, you did. This is right, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. It drives so nice. Yeah, I feel like it almost feels like a toy car. So it's like. I use a toy car. Yeah. Okay. Let, let me know the way, Maestro. Let me Okay. Why all up in my grill? Like, person behind me. All up in my right. business. Yeah. Like, you had another car earlier like that. I car. know, it's just like, why are you out of the my space for that? Like, I'm a newbie. It's like, allow me to be. Well, we have the traffic lights. Tell me why. Okay. Oh, okay. 
Okay. I'm on the bike lane. Does that matter? Yeah. Because it turned orange when I was on it. So, so I have gone? Yes. Okay. Yes. If it's a driving test, it would be better advice for me to give you... Just to go? To go, yeah. Okay. The reason is if we stop in the bicycle box, exactly fail us. Yeah. <gasps> really? It's a fail? Yeah. That's crazy. That's going to be a, a minor. Because uh, I, is it more dangerous for me to have gone and potentially, you know, could be. conflict? Could be. Could be. Yes. Um, so in that scenario, do stop. Yeah. That's to what avoid I mean. an accident. Yes. Yeah, so that should be a minor or major at max. Three points from your license and a fine. <gasps> Highway code. Nah, they need to they need to sort that out. That's crazy. You heard about the changes they want to put in place. New drivers will not be allowed to drive after nine PM and you won't <laughs> be allowed to take any passengers with you. Either. That's only if you're under twenty five, right? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'm not yeah. that. I, mean, right. I could oh. look like I'm under twenty five, but I'm a big woman. Oh, let's go. Let's go. Okay, so Yeah, so you know the lines. Lovely, right? We're gonna follow the traffic, so it's just straight at the roundabout, second exit. Okay. Stop at the giveaway lines, obviously. Let the bus go, or just go. Have a look for the signals and do okay. look at the wheels cool. as well. Yeah, wheels yeah. are good. Yeah, lovely. Well done. Excellent Signal decision. Out. Yeah, nice. Well done. Yeah. If you can, brilliant. Okay, so this is a little bit of a test. At the end of the I road. Need to go. Yeah, at the end of the road. At the end of the road, turning right. Mm -hmm. Okay. That's that signal now, or this? Yeah, good timing yeah. for your signal. Well done. Just roughly five car lengths from the junction. Mm -hmm. I think that's pretty much where we are. So very good timing. Could not go wrong with five car lengths, even if there was a road like where these vans are. Yeah. Maybe if we were in traffic, we wouldn't do it. But if yeah. we were on the move, we'd still signal here and then take that turn. Why is this guy cutting in like, he just waited like a normal person, but you had to turn. Okay. Jeez, I'm coming. And the next traffic lights turn here. Okay, well, oil bike. Good signal, good early signal. Can they go? Oh, is he gonna let me go? Okay, Nice, good confidence Ooh. there. Well done, that's very good. Yeah. Excellent with all your mirrors, which you were talking about earlier mm -hmm. as well, yeah? Mm -hmm. You knew all about the motorbike. Yeah, the guy, the motorbike guy's on the road as well. I'm gonna let him go because he's a learner. Girl, are you being so funny for me right now? <laughs> Don't do that. I'm gonna oh, keep to the left if it's safe. Okay. Classic. Yeah, good idea. Yeah, just to help the motorbike. Yeah. Okay. At the second traffic light, mm -hmm. turn left. Good. This ain't no manual. This is so much easier. I can actually focus on driving <laughs> instead of on the the what's it called? The clutches. The clutches. Well, this is the dedicated left lane anyway, right? Yeah, still good for the pedestrians. All the cars sure. should know, but pedestrians might not be too cleared up. It's a nice signal. I use. Like, I watch the signals as a pedestrian. Yeah, right. I can relate to that. Yeah, me too. And then I get annoyed the <laughs> Yeah, right. And then I open my big mouth. <laughs> this is a manual all the part of the handbrake. Yeah, uh, handbrake neutral, those days are kind of fading out. Kind of, yeah. Uh, it's a nice feature actually. Push this brake hold. Mm -hmm. Now that it says brake hold, just take your foot off the brake. So once you stop, from now on, yeah. if you want, if you want, Yay! you just take your foot off the brake. Relax. Yeah. So as long as you stop, the car's not moving, it will hold the brake for you. And I can just go and all go. Yeah, you can just go. This is the best error. That's on lots of different cars, it's not just this one. Amazing. Good 
question. No signs, 20 miles an hour. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> got no problem. Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> Very good with your crossing. Well done. Uh, so, <clears throat> start again. Uh, no signs right. and regular street light. Yes, 30. Now, the reason why I said 20. Yeah. But uh, yeah, you're correct. Yes, no signs, regular street lights, theory test tells us it's a 30. Yeah. Otherwise, we'll have regular signs telling us the speed limit. Mm -hmm. Yeah, to be honest, the car was moving anyway. Oh, excellent. Yeah, you heard that. Uh, the car will beep at 20 and beep at 30, just to give you a warning about what speed we're traveling at. It doesn't mean that we've necessarily done anything wrong. Mm -hmm. uh, just relating speed limit to the test. If you go over the speed limit a little bit, as long as you reduce it quite quickly, mm -hmm. um, usually not a big deal. If we go over the speed limit, limit a lot, mm -hmm. that's where it's serious. Usually more than five miles an hour or something like that. Yeah. Okay, it's kind of a little bit of a tricky roundabout to see, mm -hmm. and it's even harder to see to the right. So just have some care here to check that right side of the roundabout, mm -hmm. and if it's safe, follow the road ahead. Okay. Lovely, good use of the traffic there as a block of car, nice observations, well done. The big solid black line shows you the main road, so no signal, just following the main road, and the okay. sign shows us where the main road goes. Okay. Right, talking about signs, I'm going to ask you to follow some signs next to Greenford. Okay. Right. Um, on the test, this might happen. The examiner might ask you to follow signs as well. Mm -hmm. So if you're unsure, ask the examiner and it should help with the direction. Okay. Okay. Otherwise, just follow the signs to Greenford. Signal very well timed, good roundabout. Oh. Very good. <laughs> nice hearing. Oh, it's a normal road, yeah? 30. I don't 20 know. still. Yeah. It says 20 though. Correct. Good distances, you're not getting too close to the pavement, you're not intimidated by the traffic, you're still giving enough space. A little bit hard to see. Yeah. Oh, oh shoot, I didn't even check. Turning left. She left, yeah? First exit. Nice observations. Good double check, well done. Examiners do always want to see a double check at every junction. Okay, it doesn't look like we'll be able to avoid this, so we're just going to slowly keep with the traffic. Okay. Excellent, well done. You don't want to stop on a zebra crossing. Something quite new to me as well, I've never seen that before. Mm. See the zebra yeah. crossing and then there's like a bicycle crossing. Yeah. So it's separate. Obviously we wouldn't want to stop on that as well, yeah. so good job. Uh, oh. Nice as well what you're doing here with this junction. Mm -hmm. You were keeping the entry point open, so yeah. we wouldn't block any traffic from yeah. entering that road. All very important. All of those would have been a fail mm -hmm. if you'd stopped on the crossing or the uh, block the road from the traffic. Mm -hmm. You can hear the comments section. <laughs> no, Scott, it's not a fail. Uh, <laughs> all right, fair enough. If no one comes along, it's not a fail. You're right. <laughs> But don't do it. But I don't want to risk it. Exactly. Don't risk it for a chocolate biscuit, okay? That's what I'm saying. I know how these examiners are, especially in my area. It's the worst place to go. What? Is it don't risk it for a chocolate biscuit or risk it for a chocolate biscuit? Would you risk it for a chocolate <laughs> biscuit? Would you risk it for? Yeah, Tang Tempo. Plumstead or Thames Smooth? He's from Plumstead. He is Plumstead. But he so went yeah. to school in Tangsmooth. Oh, I see. He went to school in Yeah. Oh, is it? Yeah, oh. boy. What was it St. Paul's? No, I think it was Willie's. 
Yeah. I'm in my orange party, actually. Yeah. And so did the guy from Dallas. Yeah, that's as well, too. Uh, Marvin. Uh, Marvin. Uh, Marvin. 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 A lot of famous people from ENDS. Yeah, so I haven't heard anything from Tiny Temper since those times though, you know that? I'm yeah. sure he's doing something. He's a businessman now. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, actually it's crazy that he actually went to him. I was thinking about him today. He married like a girl who, her dad's um, a billionaire. So he's making money, he's making money. He's... Yeah, he's a definitely a businessman. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> he's making, talk about gener generational wealth. Bah. That's, that's that F you money. Right? Okay, where are we going? Tell him right. Ooh, before, after. Lovely making your way to a position where you can see the traffic clearly. So if that means you have to kind of come up here to this. Okay, yeah. Excellent double check with your observations. Lovely, yeah, really nice. You did rely on the signal from that other driver. Yeah. You checked again to just double check, right? Yeah. Yeah, that was nice. Well done. Thank you. Yeah, that's exactly what the exam was looking at. I know I've said it a million times and I'll keep saying it a million times. Observations, like the ones that we just showed, they're the number one reason why people fail them because they don't do those observations. Oh! <laughs> I was thinking of that for how long? You got it. There's no side roads, you didn't pass any. Yeah. You tried to be careful just in case there was a side road. So sometimes, again, another nice point with your driving, yeah. when the steering's very smooth and gentle, mm -hmm. which is good, safe, uh, the signal might not register like a full turn. Yeah, yeah. So it's stay on. Yeah. So if you feel like you're doing a lane change or maybe mm -hmm. a gentle exit like your roundabouts just now, yeah. just look out for that signal that might stay on. Okay. okay, ignore the signs now. We're gonna stop the it's called independent driving. Okay. So I'm gonna give the directions again. Okay. So what I'd like you to do is just keep to the right, like the black car in front, yeah. the Lexus, or maybe this Jeep. Mm -hmm. And we're gonna use the right lane. There's no lane marking at the moment, so we could say it's one lane, but there will be a lane marking soon, and then we're gonna keep the right lane. At the roundabout turn right, second exit. Okay. Seen this ever crossing? Yep. That tree was hiding that pedestrian. Yeah. It's a really bad place to have a tree. <laughs> There's one on the other side as well. Yeah. Which exit? This, this one. one. Lovely. I'm kind of blocking. What are you looking at? <laughs> or maybe because of the camera on top. You know what I've always said? I never understand why people in the UK actually have convertibles. Because it's not sunny enough for, it, <laughs> for anyone to invest in a convertible. Like, rarely. One or two weeks. Right? One or two weeks max, <laughs> you're gonna enjoy that convertible. And that's when all of the convertible users come out because they're like, yeah, this is my time to shine. I'm gonna show everyone in my drop top, like. Uh, then you gotta be under the age of 40 to drive a convertible. Really? Otherwise, <laughs> <laughs> it just looks weird. Right? Just like so, a sugar daddy. To all the sugar daddies out there, yeah. <laughs> right. Never always rest. Right? Uh, keep the right side, actually, there's less traffic. Okay. Just follow the road ahead. Yeah, thank you. Everyone's gonna hate me. That oh, this is so boring. Like she's driving well. <laughs> they want me to fail. They want me to fumble. Let's spice that up in a sec. Hey, wait. Is this still twenty? No. Nope. But it is actually, I think there might be a speed change somewhere here. Okay, so seems like everyone wants to go on dual carriageway today. Alright, now there is a test center quite close. The next road is actually the road that this test center's on. Mm. This one's Greenford. Mm -hmm. Since we've just kind of come this way, I think what we'll do is we'll just go to the test centre on mm -hmm. a short break. Okay. And then maybe we'll put the sat nav on and I'll show you a little example of a test route from this area. Nice. Yeah, see how you feel. Mm -hmm. 
So this has taken out all the anxiety from driving. Like before, I was so like hyper aware and had to think about so many different things. And now I can just focus on driving and clutch control and <laughs> gear changing. And I'm trying not to moan about manuals as well. So <laughs> Do it, do it. <laughs> uh, traffic lights turning a little more on the road that the test centers on. Okay. We're going to go over a mountain first, okay. which will have its challenges. Like life. And then, mountain. Uh, yes. the mountain. Yes. Something life. else as well. Oh. I won't spoil it. Okay, left. Yeah. Yeah, once we're over the mountain with it. Don't cross the road, please. Don't cross the road. Nice please. signal. Good. I think that person actually saw your signal. Yeah. I don't know on the phone as well, but it kind of yeah. looked up. I think they saw that. Yeah. And they stopped. They're gone. Because I was like, I am not something in the road for you, bro. We get a megaphone as well. <laughs> I don't want to do that so bad. Get out the way. Woo. Yeah. <laughs> Did you get in trouble for that? Yeah. Probably. Yeah, we get in trouble for that. <laughs> Literally, are you just gonna like? Well, that's going to back to right? Well, you need to, otherwise, yeah. we'll have an accident. There, yeah, so, yes. Bloody motorcycle is still on the let me go. It's like, hello, let's look at the clean. Nice motor chips. You're looking out for those motorbikes. Well done. Yeah. Okay, so you might see over the trees, more trees. Mm -hmm. That's the mountain. Something's happening here. Yeah, people are getting out of their cars and stuff. Would you turn left? Okay. Yeah. okay. So what we can do is just cut that road out for today. It looks like there's something really bad happening there. Okay. So if you just follow this road, we'll find somewhere with a lot of space, and we'll park up somewhere. Okay. Maybe try my late direction. So I just followed the road instead. I thought okay. that road was coming up late, so I thought it was quite quick. Okay, so I think there's another little left here, so we just try to take this little left here. Okay. Lovely. And in fact, as you turn left here, can you just stop somewhere here? Yeah. Anywhere is fine. Just give yourself plenty of room to move off. There's lots of space here. Beautiful. Lovely. All right, crank that handbrake up. Lovely. Push that P for park, and you can completely relax. Woo! Well done. So, how long had it been actually since you last drove? It has to be like a year. A year. Yeah, definitely. A All year. right. Okay. So, would you say you're pretty much where you were a year ago? I know minus the clutch, but feeling wise. Feeling wise, I feel like I'm so much more confident than I normally am. Cool. I think because I'm driving an automatic. And a really easy automatic. Yeah, well. it's quite smooth, isn't it? Yeah. Um, and I have a super cool and relaxed drive driving instructor, which is very essential. A lot of people say that. <laughs> um, any questions before we sort of sign off? No, but I really got in the line really well. Yeah, look, uh, what I did actually was I did a split screen one. So there's another mm. one. What I'm going to do is just get you to push this button. It says camera. Sorry, just there. Yeah. yeah. And then that was the split screen. See that yellow yeah, line? Yeah. See how it's right on the edge of the pavement? Mm -hmm. That's exactly why that yellow line's there. So you can Perfect. place it. Yes, it's really good. So you did, just did that with your normal judgment. Yeah. But you now know about that button if you want to triple check it. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So if you're doing parking or something, yeah. you just want to know for the driving test. Just have a little look. Okay, Completely cool. fine. You can use that whenever you want. Good. All right. Okay. So we're going to sign off from the driving lesson now. Mm -hmm. We're going to come back for round two, which will be your first little test route. Dare I say it, mock test? Okay, stay tuned for the next episode, and we'll see you then.